Aries, what's going on, y'all? So I'm gonna pull some cards and get a message out for y'all. I definitely do hope the messages resonate for you guys, and I definitely do hope overall the messages are useful, okay? And with that being said, Aries, we just gonna jump right into y'all video, okay? So this for Aries. You got the Ace of Swords coming out first. We love to see it with the Knight of Swords as well. And you also have the Two of Swords coming out, okay, Aries? Love to see the Ace of Swords. You got the Hierophant card coming out as well with the King of Cups. You got the Four of Cups coming out as well, Aries. You also do have the Magician card. And you got the Queen of Cups. So Aries, you or somebody else could be... What's the Four of Cups? That's the only thing I just threw this all, other than the Two of Swords. But what's this Four of Cups? With the Eight of Wands? What's the Two of Swords? You got the Temperance cards. You could be dealing with the Taurus, the Sagittarius, a Water sign. But that's more so, especially with the King and the Queen of Cups coming out, it gave me more so emotion. It didn't, they don't have to be a water sign. They definitely could be. It's definitely out here strong, but it's just given, this is a very emotional type of like, either time for you or someone or you are very emotional about another person, okay? And someone could be looking for more emotion from you. What's this King of Cups? With the Queen of Pentacles, the Eight of Pentacles, and the Devil. It could be done with the Capricorn as well. Heavy Capricorn. And what's this Queen of Cups? What's this Queen of Cups? You got the Ten of Cups. What's this Magician? You got the Fool and the Six of Swords. And what's this Knight of Swords? You got the Tower. So what's this Queen of Pentacles and the Eight of Pentacles? You have the Chariot. And what's this Ace of Swords? You got the Page of Swords. Somebody's looking for the truth. What's this Hierophant? about another relationship with the Ace of Cups. Someone feels like with the world, you're. someone feels like another individual isn't telling them the full story about a relationship that they have or had between them and somebody else, Aries. You gotta kinda take that how it resonates. But with the Ace, you got the Page of Swords with the Ace of Swords, it's like someone is actively looking for information as well. You could be also finding out some sort of purpose too with this Ace of Swords and the um, Page of Swords. You got Cancer energy out here as well. What's this devil? Someone could even be having like a work relationship as well. Or, or someone could feel like someone's working too much too. Yeah, with the Seven of Wands to kind of almost use it as a distraction from them as well. With the Ten of Wands, more uh, Sagittarius energy. What's this Knight of Swords with the with the Tower? With the Three of Swords. I don't know if someone feels like someone like isn't paying enough attention to them with the Lovers at the bottom. What's this higher from with the Ace of Cups? With the Knight of Cups, Aries, and it is coming out in reverse. So what's this magician again? What's this magician? You got the page of cups. I don't know if someone feels like you're trying to manifest something without them, especially when it regards to like a new individual. Is this queen of cups and the um, queen of pentacles the same person? Is the queen of cups and the queen of pentacles the same person with the world? And you got the eight of cups. 
Yeah, I would say no, they're not. They're two different energies. They're two different people. And it's almost like, yeah, with the hermit at the bottom, it's like someone's very nervous about you walking away from them and going towards someone else, Aries. Someone can even be worried of like another person elevating when like in regards to work and leaving them. What's this four of cups with the eight of wands? With the seven of cups? Someone is like not happy with like another person's options in life. It feels like literally with the queen and king of swords coming out for the seven of cups. Aries, I don't know. Someone is like casting a lot of illusions. Like someone feels like, but it's two people. Like it seems like it's two people who are out for gain in their relationship. Like something was not about literally it wasn't about genuine love it was more so stability it was more so okay you want this i'm gonna just say a simple example you want a certain lifestyle i want this certain lifestyle that's basically team up together you're attractive i'm attractive i like you you like me so let's kind of see where it goes you get what i'm saying it's almost like two people like got together because yes, they were physically like attracted to each other, but they got to know each other while being in a relationship. Like it wasn't no courting, getting to know each other, really texting too much of like, you know, oh, what's your favorite color? Like hopefully that's like making sense, but it's just given the energy of two people coming together for, to build some sort of stability, but they're both like casting illusions around each other. Like they're both being fake, Aries, in a sense. I'm not saying you're being fake, but it's almost, it's, A relationship isn't based on like love or actual feelings it seems like it's not like it's almost given these two people don't even really <laughs> like like each other in a sense Delilah What's this four of cups? Yeah, you got the seven of pentacles. It was all about like gain. Or two people could have like came together to do something to you thinking they were gonna gain, I don't know. What's really going on here with the four of wands? What's this two of swords with the temperance? And it's almost like someone's comfortability, their peace is now being compromised for whatever action they took. Yeah, literally. With the Ten of Wands, whatever action someone took towards you or a certain situation revolving you, it was almost like someone isn't resting properly. Like someone feels uneasy. Heavy Sagittarius energy with the Five of Pentacles. Like they feel like no one like really trusts them. What's the Knight of Cups in reverse? With the Ten of Pentacles, and it could be family, like community, like someone or a couple is being looked at as like a like like mischievous, like really really fake. Yeah, with the judgment, like the community they they are in, their friend group as well, family members as well, peers is like is looking at some sort of couple. Like with the harsh side eye. Or something that they did. And it was like faking some sort of like emotion, faking something. Someone someone was faking something. And it could have been to drop again somebody to like quit a job, to move out of a house as well. They wanted to end somebody's comfortability as well. So now they're like, they're being looked at as like, almost like tyrants. Like, I don't, mm. like a couple or someone like individually made someone feel so uncomfortable to where they had to like walk away or they felt like that's what they had to do. I didn't have no other option, but to like walk away, leave something behind. And it's like the people that know about it or like something is coming to light like i don't know if someone was basically telling people like look this person is doing this or 
this couple is doing this to me. Like, I, like, I, I don't, but it was something to where it's like the illusion was like these people, like whoever was trying to express someone doing something to them, it definitely feels like it was like a couple. Like it wasn't one person, like two people working together to kind of like hide what the other person was doing or what they really had like going on. Or, you know, someone, a partner was looking out for the other partner because someone was saying like someone was doing something to them. Hopefully y'all keeping up with me, but people are seeing now because whoever was driven out of something, whether it was a job, a, a home, uh, their own community, whatever. Um, whoever had to walk away for a little while, they're doing better. Like I don't. With this Queen of Pentacles, this Eight of Pentacles, the Chariot, the Devil, the Seven of the uh, Seven of Wands for the Devil as well. Like someone's blocking off all negativity, all negativity, all like evil energy as well. And it's almost like them doing that is shining light on this person or this couple that was like almost like i want to be honest like harassing them that's what it feels like like somebody was trying to harass somebody and get under their skin as well and that's coming basically to light these, these this couple is being watched this couple is being watched because i felt like they had a lot to say about like a queen of pentacles energy because that's the energy that's out here because the king and queen of cups they're a couple the queen and king of swords are a couple as well the queen of pentacles came out alone so you could be coming out because the King of Pentacles was at the bottom before as well. You could be coming out as this Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles energy as well, Aries, where it's like you, you're worried about your stability right now. And that's the thing. People seeing you, again, be okay or this Queen of Pentacles energy be okay. And it kind of like, again, shine light on this couple or someone specifically because they're not doing as well, basically. And they see almost that the person that left or escaped the situation isn't almost like like they're not in drama or they're in a lot less drama now that they're not around this person or this couple, basically. And it's almost like this couple or this person is like struggling in a sense. Yeah. What's this Ten of Pentacles with this uh this judgment? You got the sun. And the two of wands. Yeah, I think a light was shined on like who the true, like not victim, meaning like you should want to be a victim, you shouldn't want to be characterized characterized as a victim, but it's almost like the light is being shown on like who was the victim versus the victimizer, basically. Like people are aware. Like if you think, mm. yeah, with the Queen of Wands, Aries, your energy finally kind of like coming out as well. I guess you could say the Magician too, could be considered as your energy. What's this Eight of Cups with this world? This is Eight of Cups with this world. With the Six of... Like, I'm telling you, whoever got out of a certain situation, they're, like, free and successful. Like, they're doing their own thing as well. That girl. With Delilah. With the Eight of Swords at the bottom. And it's almost like the people that are... That was left... In this situation, this couple or this person in specific is almost like all they think about is what they said, what they did, how they did. It. And it's more so lies. Like, I don't know why, but it was a lot of lies being spewed in a situation to make themselves look better. This couple look better. It's almost like this couple or someone wanted to be a victim. They wanted whoever was pushed out of a home, a job, a community. They wanted that person to look like the victimizer. Like he or she just, they just won't leave me alone. They're always harassing me, but behind closed doors is, or, you know, when people aren't looking, it's this couple doing this and they like cover for each other. They take each other's, you know, take up for each other, which isn't a bad thing, but they're like, like the energy was negative. Like it was almost like giving harassment. And you can see that it got them nowhere. It literally got them nowhere. What's this Queen of Pentacles, the Eight of Pentacles with the Chariot? 
You got the Wheel of Fortune? Yeah, this Queen of Pentacles energy is on fire. On fire with the Eight of Swords and the Three of Cups. And it's almost like whoever this couple, because it's given a couple that was like in cahoots versus someone or again, a, someone in specific with the hermit at the bottom. And it's almost like these people, they feel let, they, they feel the energy of like you not wanting to mess with them or you not wanting to be like close to them or friendly at all. And all they can do again is think about the things they said and or did. Like it's nobody's fault but their own type of situation. Especially if you're standoffish with someone, it's like they know why. Like they're not oblivious to the reasonings why you don't want to be like close to them or cool with them. They're not they're not clueless. They know why. What's this um ace of swords with the page of swords? You got the lovers. When I say they're being like watched with the hangman, what's the hangman? What's the hang? Yeah, somebody was doing a lot of lying. This couple. You got Gemini energy out here as well. What's this? With the nine of cups. What's this hanging in with the nine of cups? You got the Empress. You got the Empress. With the Emperor at the bottom of the deck. <laughs> hey. Your, your energy Aries at the bottom. You got Taurus, Libra energy, Pisces, Gemini. Like somebody was trying to make an Empress, Emperor person like very, very like uncomfortable. So they wouldn't be able to stand in their power and they were using like a tactic of like two against one almost. Like people are gonna believe the two of us. They're not gonna believe just him or her. It don't matter what they say kind of like thing. It's terrible. My bad, y'all. <laughs> But yeah, you had the hangman, the nine of cups with the empress as well. Like I was saying, it was almost like there was like a couple or someone in specific. It's definitely given a couple, two people or just two people who are very close, um, almost like in cahoots type of like thing. And it was almost like they didn't want to see you stand in some sort of like power. Like it definitely was jealousy. Yeah, but it was something about like you just standing up for yourself in some sort of like feminine or masculine energy. Both of these people are distorted masculine and feminines. I'm gonna just be completely honest with you. Um, no matter the gender or whatever role that they play, um, they're both, I feel like, distorted. Um, yeah. And it was something with like trying to stall this empress or emperor energy that you were like creating for yourself and. Mm -hmm. Like, they didn't want you to seem intuitive, smart. Like, you knew what you were talking about as well. It's, it's, it's hard to wrap my mind around. What's this hangman with the Nine of Cups and this Empress? Literally, with the Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Wands. Like, these people have seen you at one point in time manifesting something very, very well for yourself. Like these could have even been individuals, especially if you're a feminine, this was a feminine, if you're a masculine, this is a masculine who was trying to like mimic you. They were trying to mimic you, manifest like the way you do as well. Like you were being, it feels like watched in a sense. But they were trying to knock you down. I don't know. With the four of swords. What's this knight of swords with the tower? And then you got the three of swords as well. You got the moon. These people definitely tried to hide this betrayal as well for as long as they kind of like could. That's the sad part too. Like I feel like these people know that like, you know that they're like weird. Yeah, with the Ace of Wands or like they, they were trying to almost like siphon some sort of like energy. They were trying to bother you antagonize you as well and it was almost like they were like almost like energy harvesting off of you the more you paid attention to them and what they like were doing to you it was almost like it made them 
honestly like fit like it was a high to them it was an adrenaline so it was like the first time you argued or you got in a disagreement with them and that was squashed it's like they could not wait for the next one even if they had to initiate it like do a little weird i don't know mm, it's weird with the page of wands coming out the five of swords the five of cups and the king of pentacles aries you're coming out is like a king of pentacles energy and that's what they wanted to stop or somebody was doing this to a king of pentacles energy some sort of earth sign a libra Again, a Taurus, a Pisces, a Gemini, like, mm. but whoever this was done to, they're on the up and up. Like, 55 can be of importance. Five. Yeah, with the King of Wands coming out as well. The Nine of Pentacles, literally, and the Seven of Swords. Like, someone was jealous of someone's independence. They couldn't stand it. With the Nine of Wands coming out in reverse, and it's almost like someone has to drop that now. Like, whoever this person is, they act like they're not intimidated by you, but they are. Like they act like you're, they don't pay attention to you. You, 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 they don't think about you. They're not like, yeah, it's almost like intimidated. Like this is some, mm, this is like a overly masculine person or this is a feminine who tries to be like sexy in a way. Like I can't really explain what I mean by that, but this is a feminine who uses almost like what she has as a weapon instead of like like a femme fatale but in the worst way basically like it's a, a, a an overly masculine type of like guy or again it's a it's a it's a woman who like is a, a she uses what she has to get what she wants basically like she will do that she will yeah she'll fuck your man okay that's the type of feminine this basically is and they're together <laughs> like they're together i don't know aries this was this was very interesting i feel like okay but um yeah i definitely do hope the messages resonate for you aries and i definitely do hope the messages were overall useful for you and with that being said aries until next time